I think it should look like all of us in New Zealand. That's what it should look like. It should be diverse to represent our diversity in our populations. And that doesn't mean that we leave somebody behind. They're all going to be with us. And that's what our, our Mata Pono is about. It's about afiatu, afimai, nga piki, nga heke. Tu kaha, tu kotai, stand together. And all those, those, and they're very simple principles, they're very simple values, yet they're powerful values. And we need to have those as, as signposts, those as, as a road map to guide us into a future that we will be proud to be part of and that it will be a legacy that we will be proud to leave. Kia ora. And, and I've always thought about the, you know, from the years of being a delegate, I think about the union not as the officials, not as head office, but as the members. And so if you're going to become a treaty based organisation, it's about the members. And it's about the members taking action within their sphere of influence. And some of the crew have got bigger spheres of influence mm. than others. But, it, but the, the beauty of the union is that it's about connecting up spheres of influence. And collectively, we can do extraordinary things. And so, yeah, it's about every single teacher, researcher, every member of this union taking action. And if everybody has a go, reflects and have another go, and we enter into being a community of learning, we can have get some momentum going and hopefully there'll be no backsliding. We just steadily forward. Aloha te tahi ki te tahi, that we care for each other. And I think despite our, our um, makeup, despite our differences, that we still have that um, responsibility of care for each other. And I think that um, we're doing quite well in that area, but there's still areas that we can improve on in terms of not only as a union, but as a people and a nation. <laughs>